Well, good evening, everybody. Welcome back to another vlog and another video. Hope hope you all had a great hope you all had a great day today and stuff. Um, uh, ho hope your day is all gone. Hope your day all, all hope your day all went all right for you all today, or or better yet, hope your day all went hope your day all went really good for you today. <coughs> Excuse me. So in so in today's vlog, what I thought I would do is um uh, so so yesterday you saw that um uh, I had set up my um uh, Christmas delights uh, porcelain electric porcelain lighthouse and my big Merry Christmas sign and stuff. You know, two out of quite a few things, two out of a good number of things that I got for thirty fourth birthday this year, a little over a week ago and stuff. You probably, you may also recall that I also got a Crock-Pot recipe card collection, um, uh, a recipe card collection tin kind of thing. And so in today's vlog, what I thought I'd do is go through that and uh, see what kind of interesting recipes we can find. As you can see, I got it right here. Yup, that's it. Crock-Pot recipe card collection. Still got the wrapping on it, so... Let's open it up. Let's let's remove all the let, let's remove all the let's remove all the wrapping. Let's let's open it up. There's the label right there. <clears throat> Crockpot, the original slow cooker. And recipe card collection. All right, all right. I've opened it up. There's this plastic thing in here. Got to take out. So, so take all the recipe cards out. Let's read them off. Warm blue crab bruschetta. Yep, there it is. Warm blue crab bruschetta. Not gonna read off, you know, like everything that's involved in recipes, but you know, if y'all want, I'm sure there's probably some. There's, I'm sure there's probably a crockpot recipe uh, website you can go on and maybe look that stuff all up. And uh, whatever I'm, uh, <clears throat> whatever recipes I end up reading off, that you know. You can obviously probably just type them in when you go online and stuff. And then look at them like that. Alright, next one. Melt melt your mouth melt your melt your mouth uh drumettes. So yep. It's drumstick chicken and and uh drumstick chicken and stuff. Brats and beer. Easiest three cheese fondue. Barley caviar. Chesapeake Bay crab dip. Party meatballs. We've seen that a lot. Am I, am I making y'all hungry yet, folks? Leave a comment down below on whether I'm making you hungry already or what and stuff, folks. Creamy artichoke parmesan dip. There it is right there. Creamy artichoke parmesan dip. Sauced Little Smokies, which they also have called them cocktail wieners before, but the way they call it is Sauced Little Smokies. We've had these a number of times before. Take a look. That's right, Sauced Little Smokies. You've probably seen that before, right? 
bacon wrapped scallops. Nacho dip. I think we've heard of that before. Poison Sriracha Chicken Wings. There it is. Poison Sriracha Chicken Wings. Angelic Deviled Eggs. How about, how about that? Angelic Deviled... There it is. An Angelic Deviled Eggs. I mean, perhaps maybe I could also do another vlog at a later date, you know, someday fairly soon, and maybe, maybe like, maybe perhaps I could, maybe perhaps I could do a part two of this, and I could, I could read off some of the ingredients of maybe not all the recipes here, but some of the ones that definitely look good, and I'm sure probably some of the ones that probably look look good to you all, to you all uh, viewers and and uh, fans of my channel, of my YouTube channel and stuff. But for tonight, we'll just keep just briefly reading off the titles of the recipes. Okay, so the next one, steamed pork buns. There, there it is. Yep, again, steamed pork buns. <clears throat> Beef and black bean chili. Yep, beef and black bean chili. Kickin' chili. Who knows what that who knows what that means? Kickin' chili. Chicken and black bean chili. That's interesting. I like that. There it is. Chicken and black bean chili. Beef chuck chili. Getting into a lot of chili recipes here. Yep, there it is. Beef chuck chili. Yeah. Chili's been a chili's been a pretty popular crock pot uh, thing to do. And that's why and that's why I think there's so many chili recipes here. Here's another chili and, and of course, obviously, here's another chili recipe. Three bean three bean turkey chili. Well, I'm sure almost I'm sure almost all of us we've all almost had turkey chili and stuff, but this one is again three bean turkey chili. There it is, three bean turkey chili. Chorizo, chorizo or chorizo, whatever it is, chorizo or chorizo chili. Yep, chorizo or chorizo chili. This one I've already, this one I've seen before, weeknight chili. There it is, weeknight chili. Best ever chili. Yep, best ever chili. Here's another interesting chili recipe, black and white chili. There it is, black and white, black and white chili. My uncle would like this because he because he's a big time vegetarian, and so I think with kind of kind of my kind of my cousin, believe it or not, too, uh, veg, vegeta vegetarian vegetarian because because they're both they're both vegetarian and stuff, and so uh, so this one is vegetarian chili. There it is, vegetarian chili. That means there's obviously no meat in it, obviously. When when they say vegetarian, that means there's no meat in it, obviously. So, you know, just a bunch of vegetables and, you know, whatever other liquids are involved. All right, next, chipotle vegetable chili with, with chocolate. <clears throat> a what? 
I wonder where that came from. Ch chipotle vegetable chili with chocolate. Yeah, chipotle vegetable chili with cho with chocolate. Corn and two bean chili. There it is. Yep. Corn and two bean chili. Mediterranean chili. There it is. Mediterranean chili. Black bean mushroom chili. Wow, that, that one's new. There it is. Black bean mushroom black bean mushroom black bean mushroom chili. That's that that's new. That chili recipe is new. Well, we've heard of this one. Well, I've heard of this one. I'm sure a lot of us have heard of this one. Turkey chili. There it is. Turkey chili. Texas chili. Well, Here's the last, yep, well, here's the last chili recipe again, like I just said. Texas chili, yep. This is the last chili recipe, yep, there it is. Texas, Texas chili. Texas chili, yep. Now we're getting into something else. Asian beef with broccoli. Yep, there it is. Asian beef with broccoli. There's my phone. I'll let the I'll let the answering machine get it. I'll call them back in a little bit. Let's let's con let's continue and finish up with this. We'll just let the answering machine get that. I'll just let it finish ringing first before before we go on. Hello. Okay. Let's resume. Well, you've all... Yep, it's my dad. I got something going on um, later on tomorrow morning, so he's probably just kind of checking in about that, probably. But anyway, I'm, uh, if I can talk over, you know, the answer machine. We've all, we've all heard of... We've all heard of camp. We've all we've all heard of camp fired up. Well, not, not not camp fired up, but we've all had sloppy. Jo we've all had sloppy joes before. This one right here happens to be a sloppy joe recipe. Camp fired up sloppy joes. There it is. Camp fired up sloppy joes. Chicken teriyaki. There it is. Chicken teriyaki. Harvest Harvest Ham Supper. Yep, Harvest Ham Supper. Chicken Mozambique. That's interesting. Yep, Chicken Mozambique. Classic Pot Roast. A dual, a, a dual, a dual a and cabbage crock. This is probably a good St. Patrick's Day, um, uh, you know, thing to do in crock pot, since it all includes like you know sausage and cabbage. Yep, there it is again. A dual a. And a dooley and cabbage crock. Again, this might this could be a good St. Patrick's Day uh, crock pot recipe to do. And it's like around or 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 on St. Patrick's Day, chicken scallop chicken scallopine in Alfredo sauce. Chicken scampine in, in Alfredo sauce. So simple supper. This one looks like it comes with like. Pork roast or pot roast, potatoes, carrots, uh, some garlic cloves or celery. 
and stuff, but I'll read the recipe later and see closely what it is. Yep, so, so simple supper. Chicken and biscuits. We've all heard of chicken and biscuits before. Chicken, chicken and biscuits. Corned beef and cabbage. Now, this one we know would definitely be a great St. Patrick's Day recipe for sure. Corned beef, corned beef and cabbage. Yep. Perfect St. Patrick's Day recipe. Shepherd's pie. Yep, there it is. Shepherd's pie. Boneless chicken catch. Boneless chicken cacciatore. Yep. Boneless chicken cacciatore. Southern smothered pork chops. Southern smothered pork chops. Ancho chili and ancho. Ancho chili and lime pork tacos. Ancho chili, ancho chili and lime pork tacos. Miso po miso poached salmon. Mash mashed rutabagas and potatoes. Orange, orange spice, orange spice glazed carrots. Orange spice glazed carrots. Slow roasted potatoes. Slow roasted potatoes. Lentils with walnuts. Lentils with walnuts. No fuss macaroni and cheese. Rustic cheddar mashed potatoes. Rustic ch cheddar mashed potatoes. Oral's con queso. Red cabbage and apples. That's interesting. Escalloped corn. That's interesting. Escalloped corn. Collard greens. Collard greens. Slow cook. This one, this next one's interesting. Slow cooked succotash. Slow cooked succotash. Yep. <laughs> slow cooked, slow cooked, suck it, slow cooked, suck it, suck it, slow cooked, suck it, ash. Yep. Poblano cream, poblano, pablo, poblano creamed corn. Poblano clean, <laughs> clean, no. Poblano creamed corn. Curried cauliflower and potatoes. Curried cauliflower and potatoes. Cheesy polenta. Che there it is, cheesy polenta. Now this next one we've all had before, barbecue baked beans. Check that out. Barbecue baked beans. Yep. Seen a lot of people do do baked beans in their crock pot for sure. Now we're getting into. Now we're getting in. Now these at least these next couple or. Yeah, well, looks like the next few, we're kind of getting in more into kind of more like desserts and stuff. Mexican chocolate bread pudding. Here it is, Mexican chocolate bread pudding. Triple chocolate fantasy. I've heard it, I've heard of that before, but I've never tried it. 
triple chocolate fantasy. Choc coconut rice pudding. Coconut rice pudding. Cherry delight. There it is, cherry delight. Pumpkin cranberry custard. That's interesting. That that's cool. There it is. Pumpkin cranberry custard. Fudge and cream pudding cake. Fudge and cream pudding cake. Bittersweet chocolate espresso cream brulee brulee. Bittersweet chocolate is chocolate espresso ch chocolate espresso chocolate espresso chocolate espresso. Chocolate espresso, chocolate espresso cream brulee, bananas foster, bananas foster, warm spiced apples and pears, warm spiced apples and pears, cinnamon roll topped mixed berry cobbler. Cinnamon roll topped mixed berry cobbler. Citrus Chinese dates with toasted hazelnuts. Citrus Chinese dates with toasted hazelnuts. Poached autumn fruits with vanilla citrus broth. <laughs> wow, I've never heard of vanilla citrus broth. I wonder how that's made. I, wa I wonder what ingredients are involved in that. I wonder how you make that. I wonder how you make. We've heard, we've all heard of chicken broth and beef, beef broth and vegetable broth before, but I've never heard of vanilla citrus broth before. I wonder how you make that kind of broth. Yep, poached autumn, poached autumn. Yep, poached autumn fruits with vanilla citrus broth. Brownie bottoms. Brownie bottoms. Yep. Spiced vanilla applesauce. Well, we've heard of we've heard of a bunch of different uh, types of applesauce and stuff, but I've never heard of applesauce applesauce with vanilla flavoring in it. So this one's interesting. Once again, spiced vanilla applesauce. Yep, spiced vanilla applesauce. And again, maybe maybe you know maybe maybe someday. Maybe someday at a later date and stuff, perhaps I'll try and do a part two and read off some of the recipes to you all. But I know there's also a whole lot of crock pot um, uh, cookbooks and stuff. I'm just kind of going to stack together all of them, uh, the, the recipe cards that I've already gone through so far. Fruit and nut. Fruit and nut, fruit and nut, fruit and nut, baked fruit and nut, baked apples. Yeah, fruit and nut, baked apples. Well, I guess these are just cards. These are just note cards and stuff included that came with the whole thing, where you can leave a note, leave a note, and what which one is probably your favorite recipe and stuff probably so far. Um, well, I think we've gotten that, I think, I think that was the final, the, I think that was the final, um, uh, crock pot recipe. So, yep, they, they go through appetizers, chilies, entrees, si sides, sides and sides, sides and sides and sweets. All right. Well. And that's it. So there you have it. Well, very quickly, looking on my uh, new uh, flat screen TV, the um, uh, Carolina Panthers versus New Orleans Saints uh, game has just started. Um, right now, Carolina Panthers got the ball. But as you can see, New Orleans uh, Saints are one out of the one out of the quite a few best. Uh, teams this year in NFL um uh the Saints of the Saints have seemed to get really good these these past couple of years and right now they're 11 and 2 
Carolina was doing all right for a while. Kind of gone downhill. Right now they're six and seven. Probably not as good as they were. Probably not as good as they used to be for a while. But they're still all right. And then game a few days ago, Thursday night football game, uh, Los Angeles Chargers and Kansas City Chiefs. That game was very close. And Los Angeles Chargers really shocked us with a 29-28 win. And so now both teams, both Los Angeles Chargers and Kansas City Chiefs, are both 11-3 and now. And one thing me and some other people have been talking about, Charger, we know how the Chargers back in the day used to be so weak and never were as good as they are now. Oh, yep, Cam, Cam Newton completion, it says. Yep, <clears throat> that's what it says. But anyways, I was saying, Chargers back in the day never were as good never were anywhere near as good as as how they are now they're so much better than they than they used to be and than, than they were back in the day they never they they never even used to come even close to making the playoffs but this year they're definitely at least going to get some use out of the playoffs for sure so of course obviously this past Thursday night football game a few days ago they obviously clinched playoff berth for sure playoff berth Playoff berth for sure, but yep. So <clears throat> I'll watch one more play here, and then we'll and then we'll end the vlog. So, Panth Carolina Panthers still got the ball, as you can see. Okay. They've made it up to the 50-yard line. All right. And they're more than halfway through the first quarter, first period, first quarter. There they are doing a replay. <clears throat> yep, there's Cam Newton. There's Cam Newton, the one they just did a little review and update about. There's the applauding and stuff. From the Carolina Panthers side. All right, one more play and then I'll end the vlog. Uh oh. It's looking like Carolina is going to be the first to score a touchdown, and they just scored. They just they just officially scored a touchdown. <clears throat> So right now the score is six to nothing. If they make the extra point field goal, score the extra point, then the score will be seven, currently seven to nothing. There's there's the replay going on. There they are, wide open and managed to score their first touchdown of the night. In uh, in this week's uh, Monday Monday in this week's uh, Monday night Monday night Monday night football Monday night football game, and they made the extra point, so the score is now seven to nothing. So yep, yep, pretty good start for this week's uh for one of this week's um uh, uh for 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 this week's one of many 2018 Monday night football games and stuff. But anyway. Oh. I'll just let you see that real quick. Yep, Monday Night Football brought to you by Google Pixel. But anyway, that's that's going to be as far as I'm going to bring it with the vlog there. I'm, I'm going to end the vlog there. If you enjoyed this vlog and this video, definitely be sure to give it a huge thumbs up for sure. And I would all like you all to go right ahead and smash that like button and definitely hit that subscribe button for sure. And I would definitely, and definitely, I would definitely, I would definitely... I, I would definitely insist that you all um, uh, that you all go down and leave a comment down below on which one of the crockpot recipes I read off to you is 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 your favorite um, uh, one or or which uh, one of the crockpot recipes I ended up reading off to you are are your favorite are your favorites that I are, are you are you 